What are the lab abnormalities you will usually see in newly diagnosed AML? So what are the lab abnormalities? Um, typically, patients are diagnosed or leukemia is suspected if there are abnormal blood counts. So typically, the white count could be either very low or high. And high means over 10,000, for instance. Some patients have 100,000, even 200,000 white count, which is life-threatening because there are so many white cells per volume, the blood cannot flow very well. So we can get what we call leukostasis in the brain or in the lungs. So that is an emergency situation that has to be you know, addressed immediately. Um, if the patient has a very low hemoglobin, low red cells, he will need transfusions. And if the patient has very low platelets, which is typical for AML, there are many other reasons. Not all low platelets are AML, but most patients with AML have low platelets. We have to monitor that carefully, and we can transfuse platelets, and we will transfuse platelets if they go very low, let's say below 15,000 to 10,000 range. A normal range is 150,000 to 400,000, 450,000. So it's a long way from 150 to 10, 15. But this is one of the things that we monitor very carefully on a daily basis during treatment.